define what specifically success looks like to you. And that way, you know what you're working towards. You have to have an end goal, a desired outcome. And it's really helpful between these two exercises, figuring out what brings you satisfaction in your work and what you'd like to have different in your life. You can start bringing the things that feel good into that process so that you can create more success. You can enjoy success quicker because you will have those feelings that come with the success you seek before you've actually arrived there. You will start feeling pieces of that success along the way. So let's say you do wanna open a bakery. You will still feel the success of making a beautiful um, cupcake before you actually open the bakery. You can get that by just making some cupcakes this weekend, right? But once it's open and you're sharing it with the public and you're a success in how that presentation happens and how smoothly the business runs and how you get to enjoy your creations and seeing the, the joy that you bring to your customers, um, the joy on their face when they bite into one of your lovely cupcakes. That's that kind of trajectory of how it works. So you bring in more of the little bit of feeling and it leads to more of that feeling and more of it and more of it and more of it. Um, I find a lot of my clients who tend to be entrepreneurs and artists um, or some sort of business owner come at it with, uh, I have to do all these things so I can't possibly do the parts I enjoy. And then they don't really enjoy the work and then it doesn't really go anywhere because they aren't experiencing those little milestones of satisfaction along the way. So really think about who and how you want to be. It's an interesting distinction, but who you want to be comes with a set of behaviors and characteristics that lead to how you want to be and how you want to be perceived by the outside world. Do you want to be someone that's really reactionary and yells a lot? Or do you want to be someone that is soothing, calm, always seems to be in control and does things effortlessly? You know, what is that outside vision um, that you might want to portray? And that helps you start tying the things together, right? Who you want to be is demonstrated through your behaviors, which is how you are. And that's what people see. That's how you model behavior for your um, family, your kids, your coworkers, your employees. So think about that a little bit. What do you want? What is your end result? What is that desired outcome? So the desired outcome is the thing that pulls you forward. It's kind of the aspiration. Where am I going with the things I'm doing? What would be ideal? at the end of that road. What would you like your life to be? What do you want? What are the things that go with that? Is it a fancy car? Is it a fancy house? Is it a tiny house? Is it all the freedom in the world to live out of a backpack and travel around the world? Is it simply to have more time to spend with your family? It doesn't matter what you want. It's what you want. And I have a firm belief that you will not desire something that you are not really meant to have. Um, and I think society pulls us back in. We want something so big or so huge that we don't even have any experience with that. And then we reel ourselves back in. I can't possibly get that because it's out of my reach. It's out of my realm. Well, it may take many steps to get there, but I believe anything is possible if you want it. Um, now, having said that, you still have to do some tasks and produce some things and have a plan and execute on the plan and implement the behaviors that go along with getting that thing, if it's a thing. But again, if you're experiencing the little bits of satisfaction along the way by completing the small, getting the same feeling by completing some of the smaller things along the way, you're golden, man. It, it all is becomes enjoyable. You feel productive at the end of the day. You feel satisfied with how things went. You are calmer. You are more interesting. Um, all of it works better together. 